What's up, everybody? It's Rick, and welcome back to another run of Death Road to Canada. Uh, we've come so close to beating the Rare Extreme Mode, and hopefully this time around we can actually get to Canada. Oh, man. Uh, Rare Extreme Mode, so very difficult. But we're going to get another run going with our Rick leader. And uh, I'm wondering if we should change up my perks. Now, I've got the mechanic perk, and it's so important to have the mechanic perk. But then again, is it? Has it really been super helpful for us? I'm wondering if I shouldn't change some things here. So, uh, you know what I'm gonna do is... Alright, I've changed things up a little bit. Rick is now ultra fit, which means I'm gonna start with four points in fitness. I want to be fit, alright? I want to be able to bash zombies as best I can. Uh, then I want to work on my strength, get super fit, get super strong. I've still got City Seeker. Uh, as far as buddy goes, we're not going with the buddy. Game mode, we're going to do rare extreme yet again. That's 60% increased difficulty. Oh, let's go. Hopefully this time we can find some good rare characters. Let's hit the road, and where are we going to stop first? Uh, I'm going to stop at a Yalmart. Let's do it real quick. Moderate sluggish in the afternoon. Okay, so I'm not a mechanic anymore. But you know what? I feel like that's going to be fine. Not being a mechanic. It's weird not having a wrench and having a knife instead. So I'm going to need to find a new weapon here soon. But it is nice being as fit as I am. Okay, we've got some bullets. Some food. Yeah, see, I'm not even breaking a sweat yet. And what do we got in here? Nothing good in this bathroom. Let's shut this door. Ooh, we have a snub nose already. Cool. Got ourselves a gun. And what do we got in this door? Okay, just another stinking bathroom with nothing good in it. This must be the good room. Yep, that has some food, gas, food, medicine, and medicine. Okay. Let's not forget this food on the way out. Okay, anything else that we've got inside the Yalmart, or is that pretty much it? We've got some bullets down here. And then let's just do one more pass to make sure we didn't miss anything. Okay, I think that that is it. Just a really quick in and out at the Yalmart. I've got to find a better weapon, though. This weapon is not going to do us very good for too long. Let's get out of here. What did we get? Six food, 33 gas, two medical supply, and some assorted ammo. Okay, good first stop. I camp out in a pro shop near a golf course. Uh, I look out this window and see a large group of zombies approaching. I could shoot golf balls. I could prepare for a siege. Shooting golf balls, does that increase my shooting? No. Fitness increased, though. Uh, my fitness is awesome now. My morale decreased. I'm hurt, but I escaped. Okay. And I'm tired. Thanks a lot, zombie Obama. Is Obama a zombie? I guess... The chances of Obama being a zombie are probably pretty good. Infested Stronghold or Lost Safe House? Hmm. I'm going to do Infested Stronghold, as scary as that sounds. And it does sound scary. I'm going to bring a golf club. That's sure to break pretty early on. But uh, I'll bring it nonetheless. Because just having a knife... Doesn't sound like a super great idea. I need to get my strength up now. Ooh, Fred's Fort. Okay. We're going to go check out Fred's Fort here shortly. And see what kind of stuff Fred was holding on to. Okay. Ooh, there we go. Got a cricket bat. And some medicines. Okay. And up here, ooh, a toilet to check. Two gas. Oh, that just didn't last long, did it? Ooh, good kitchen. All right. Food, food. Ooh, 10 gas. Not bad. Food, food. Anything up here? No. All right, let's get the heck out of here. Shut the door behind us. Whoop. Shut the door behind us. There we go. Later, guys. Okay, let's go check out Fred's Fort. Lots of zombies around these parts. Oh, lots and lots of zombies. My goodness. It was an infested stronghold, so... Whoa. What the heck was that? I just picked up that zombo point and the entire world shook? What was that about? Um, 
Having our, our grenade could be really good for us. Ooh. There we go. Uh, ooh, another grenade. There we go. And... Okay, there is something in that box that we're going to need to check out. It was ammo! Okay. So I left my knife. Hopefully that doesn't come back to bite us. Can I not pick up that chair? Really? Oh, you know what? I think it's because I'm tired. Oh, no. Oh, my God. That room is just ridiculously full of zombies. Oh, as is that one. Oh, don't bite me, please. Okay. I'm going to need to take my time with this one. I do have a gun. Start thinning out some zombie numbers. And you know what? I have grenades. I'm going to use that. Boom. There we go. Hopefully we'll come across more grenades. I'm amazed. There we go. Never mind. I was about to say I'm amazed the golf club hadn't broke, but there you have it. Golf club done broke. I'm just going to use this wood for now. There we go. Which is sure to break, but I'll use it until it breaks. Oh, so tired. So, so tired. Okay. There we go. We cleared out quite a few zombies. Feeling more safe now. Oh, there's still so many zombies in there, though. So many zombies in that room. Another golf club. Okie dokie. That just immediately broke. <laughs> yeah, let's clear. Oh, that wood broke. I may need to go get my knife again. I am running so short on weapons. And it's 4.05. I don't want to stay out here too late. Okay, at least we can get some of the zombies out of this place. There we go. That broke again. Yep. I think uh, we got to go get our knife. There we go. Watch our knife break, like, immediately now. I'm glad that I'm fit, so I can swing more without getting tired, but... Yeah, strength would be really good to increase. There we go. Okay, down to two... Okay, three. Another one came in. You know, let's go see how many zombies we managed to clear out of that room. Um, yeah, quite a few, actually. Oh, we've got a shotgun in here. How awesome is that? I don't think I have any... Sh oh, there we go. Now I've got some rounds for the shotgun. There's nothing in that room. Let's just leave that alone. Okay, I can't close that door. Ooh, this room's good. Hello, hello. Okay, there's another pistol. I'm not going to worry about that pistol at the moment. Because I have a pistol. Wait. Oh, that's just junk, seriously? It looked like ammo. Okay, yeah, leave that pistol be. And I think that that's that for this uh, stronghold. I think we've looted it to the max. We've checked that house there. Is there any other house in town to check out? Uh, ooh, here we go. Here's a house. That looks promising. Just slip in real quick. Got some rifle ammo and... Okay, just a crappy bathroom. Oh, don't bite. Don't bite. Don't, excuse me. There we go. Shut that. Oh, that's crappy. Nuts to that. Anything worth a dang up here? Nope. And... Oh, here we go. Maybe something's up here. Just a toilet. Okay. Now we gotta get through. Oh, God. 
all these zombies here. Whoa, whoa, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Whoa, 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 whoa. We just gave all those zombies the slip. That was great. All right, we're out of here. We're out of here. I think that that's that for the town. I think that we've explored it top to bottom. Into the car we go. And away we go. Okay, what did we end up with? 16 food, 14 gas, 2 medical supply, and a bunch of ammo. That was a pretty good run. Feeling good about that one. I'm fully healed. All right. Running low on medical supplies. I have 30 food at the moment. That's great. The road ahead has been flooded out, but it looks like the car could maybe still make it through. Um, I could jump it. Oh, geez. Um, plow through. What is the car's health? The car's in pretty good health right now. Um, I'm going to jump it. Ooh. I spot a makeshift ramp. And a spectacularly dangerous idea to try to jump the flooded part of the road. The car barely makes it, but sinks like an anvil. Smashed into the ground, chunks of the car, flying various directions. It took a beating, but it's still running. Ooh, the chassis is in bad shape, y'all. Real bad shape. It's ready to explode. And I am not a mechanic anymore. Um, at the end of the day, Rick hides in a drafty old house. Um, ooh, if I... I'm going to try to barricade it. Yep, yep. Ugh. My wits and my mechanical are terrible. Um, I'm attacked during the night. And I get hurt. Oh, but I love being fit, but I miss being mechanical. Rick gets a rare peaceful moment to relax on an apartment roof with no one to bother him. He decides to... Oh, can I cool it? I'm going to cool it. Oh, yeah. I spent some time just chilling. I'm a cool it character. This is great. Okay. So some of you guys commented, it's not the third cool it. It's the fourth that does something good. So I need to use my cool it's whenever I can. Um, let's see what these people are all about. Uh, they're selling rifles and pistols. You are selling some flashlights, healing sprays. I could buy that healing spray. That could be good. Um, a real doctor. Let's cut right to the chase. I can replace your head with a better head. Um, show me what you got, man. Okay, so robot head, dog head, alien head. Okay, so time to check the heads here real quick. Um, because head swap doctor. These all have their own perks and stuff. So dog, wits are zero, loyalty six. Uh, robot, plus one mechanical cap and mechanicals revealed. Aliens, plus six wits. My wits are revealed. Now, because my wits are what they are, um, I believe that that's what's going to make me a cool at character. So you know what? I'm going to keep my head because I don't want to mess with my wits. You must be selling medical supplies or training. Okay, just supplies. So I think what I'm going to do is buy some spray. Um, healing spray for six food. There we go. And now that I've got the healing spray, I'm going to give myself a little heal. Okay. There we go. All healed up. Okay, and... Let's put that back. Wield this. Okay, and let's get back on the road. And away we go. I'm really afraid of the chassis of this car being as weak as it is. I think the next stop, potentially, I will blow up. Not this guy. What a jerk. Ugh. I think I've said it before, but, um, no, no. I always tell this guy no. There's no good way of recruiting this guy. He will screw you over. Zachariah, you're the worst. I'm upset that that was one of our choices for a companion at this moment. I need a companion. Okay, the car gets stuck in a ditch near a crappy dirt road. Rick is close to getting the car out when a roaming horde draws near. Now I must distract the zombies. Getting too close. Massive, near noon, 0.7 hours. Um... I'm going to bring a gun because, obviously, the weapons that I have are pretty crap. Um, actually, the snub nose is probably better than this pistol. So let's do the snub nose instead. And I will bring the golf club just in case. Okay, let's do this. The snub nose is pretty slow, though. Actually, I guess it's fast enough. Oh, God. Ooh, thought I was going to get bit there. Okay, it was only 0.7 hours. Which isn't that long. There we go, I can escape. But first I'm going to hit up this car. 
Okay. And let's go. Yes, hit the road. Whew. All right. Got through that one. And I actually got 43 gas out of the deal, too, which is great. My car is about ready to fall apart. <laughs> I feel inspired, though, after that. So, uh, morale 1, skill gain, fitness, or shooting. Um, what's my morale at currently? It's pretty dang good. Um... Increasing my shooting could be good. I'm going to do random skill, though, and my fitness increased. Okay, my fitness could not possibly get any better. I wonder how things are further up north. Hopefully, they're good, because that's where we're heading. It's nearly time to camp, but there has been a lot of signs of bandits today. Someone needs to be awake in case of attack. Oh, jeez. Who should stay up and watch? Um, I'm going to keep driving. Oh, no. I... I refuse to camp in dangerous area and spend a tense and sleepless night driving through the dark. My morale decreases. The car veers off the road and crashes into a tree. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, without a car, I'm easy prey. They want all my weapons, ammo, gas, and supplies. Oh my gosh, this is so bad. I'm gonna have to refuse to fight. There we go, I get hurt twice. I'm gonna have to use all my healing spray. Oh no, I get called a nerd, my morale decreases. Okay, I find a rest stop after hours of walking along the road. Right in front of it is a car that looks like it can be driven. The keys must be somewhere. Very thick, calm, near sunset. Okay, so I'm going to bring the healing spray so I can heal up. Okay. It's an ice cream truck. Well, that kind of stinks. That's not going to be great for us. Okay, fully healed again. Let's go find these keys. food. Thank you. Okay, I'm just going to try to be in and out. Oh, God. I got the keys. There's another snub nose there. Speaking of the snub nose, I should pull it out. And there's some ammo there, but screw the ammo. There's way too many zombies to worry about that ammo at the moment. If I can clear some of them out of the room, maybe I'll go back for it. Uh, bathroom with nothing in it. Close the door. And bathroom with one toilet. Pick it up. There we go. And... Okay. I'm going to slip back into this room real quick and just see... Nope, nope, never mind. Nope, that ammo. It's gone. It's fine. It's not that important. It's just ammo. There's more ammo where that came from. Okay, we can go. Into the truck. The terrible, terrible ice cream truck. This is not a great car. Five food, 77 gas, 52 pistol ammo, and some rifle ammo to boot. It's a cute car, but not a good car. I guess this is forever now. I sure, f it sure feels like forever. Uh, while driving on the death road, ooh, a fishing cabin. Quiet farm. Now, I don't have a fishing pole, but hopefully there is a fishing pole here. Rick notices a small row of fishing cabins past the river. Let's go fishing. You're out of luck if underwater creatures are having their own zombie apocalypse. Uh, very thick, irritated in the morning. Let's try fishing. My spray is gone, so let's go ahead and get rid of that. Um, looks like I still only have five shots for that. Not great. Okay, let's go. Out we go. Let's go see if we can find a fishing pole real quick. Uh, yep. Fishing pole right there. And there's obviously more stuff in there, but first thing I'm going to do is go and try and get some fishing done. Uh, wait for the fish. Okay, here we go. I get a wish for power, or I get a wish for a fancy weapon. Now, again, it's been a while since I've done this, so I need to look into the wiki on this one. Fishing cabins. Here we go. Uh, so... The event, if I, okay, I don't have the food. If I wish for power, I get plus one strength, fitness, shooting, and vitality. And if I wish for a fancy weapon, um, okay, it drops. There's possible weapons I can drop, but honestly, I'm going to go ahead and do the wish for power. Oh, I can actually wish for food, which will be plus 25 food. Um, but you know what? I'm going to do wish for power. I don't need the fitness, obviously, but the increase to shooting and stuff is pretty great, so... Goodbye, fishy. Now, while food is always great, we can find food. What we can't find is extra vitality and extra strength on the road. Okay, please get away from my ice cream truck.
truck at. Speaking of my ice cream truck, let me go to the truck real quick because I can drop some stuff off. I'm gonna keep this fishing pole. Who knows if I'll need it again. Um, I'm gonna run back up and try to get some stuff from that cabin. Well, those cabins. There's several cabins that I can check out. But let's go run up here real quick and see if I can pop in here real quick and grab the rifle, the gun, the ammo. Okay. Back to my pistol. There we go. Okay, lots of zombies that we've got to get past. Give them the old slipper rooney. Okay, and let's go drop the rifle off. Uh, hello, come on. Okay, rifle is dropped off. I'm going to try and kite them down here. While stabbing a few along the way. Okay, tired now. Come on, everybody. Right down here, as far down as you can go, please. Okay. Let's go check these other cabins real quick. Don't bite. No bite. No bite. Okay. One more cabin to check real quick. Uh, oh god, so many zombies in here. I cannot believe I didn't get bit. My goodness. Still no bites. Okay, we're done with this place. We're done. Fishing cabin was a success. And we're out. Okay, what did we get? 54 ammo, 16 rifle ammo, and we've got a bunch of stuff that we put away as well. Okay, 26 food on us right now. We're doing pretty good. Whoa, it's Jazz. She's a city seeker and friend of dog. All right, Jazz. You're going to be on the team for now. I can't promise how long you'll stay on the team. If we find some rare characters that want your place, I'm going to have to give it to them. We get frustrated because the CD player in the car is jammed. Playing the same song over and over. Let's just turn it off. The group just decides to turn the CD player off. That was easy. There we go. Yeah, we would not have been able to fix that. Uh, the group finds an isolated car garage that says Master Tuners. We get some gas. Uh, we're going to drive away because none of us is good enough to fix this thing. This van is so slow, I think that we're going to, yeah, be taking our time getting to Canada this time around. Uh, police headquarters, burning house, prepper cabin. Uh, let's go to a prepper cabin. Jazz knew some people that became crazy preppers long before the zombie... Uh, happened. Their cabin is located nearby, and it's still fairly early in the day. Thick, irritated in the morning. Let's visit that cabin. What does Jazzy have on her? Just a pan. I have... Okay. So I have the pistol. Um, let's do this. Okay, I hate it when the door is blocked in these places. Okay, we're going to need to come out, Jazzy. We need to get these zombies out of the cabin if we're going to do some swing. Oh, no, my knife finally broke. Let's go see if I can get another weapon. Jazzy's already getting exhausted. So all I've got now is golf clubs, which I'm sure are going to break really quick. But we'll use them up. We need some new weapons, man. These golf clubs are not tough weapons. It's doing the trick, though, right now. If I can get my strength up, because my fitness is already maxed, then I just need to find a really good weapon for Rick. And then I think my character can become pretty useful. I hope there's weapons in the house. Oh, but there goes that weapon. Yep, we're really going to need some weapons. Let's go see how many zombies came out of the house. Um, not a whole lot. Jeez Louise. Uh, wait. Oh, tree branch. Okay, well, that'll do for now. And we did manage to get a lot of zombies out of the house. And obviously, I have my gun on me, so I can start to shoot. But I'm going to wait to shoot until I absolutely need to to conserve ammo. And luckily, it's morning, so we have plenty of time in the day. Okay, are there any other branches or anything to swing? Because this thing is bound to break soon. Oh, 
But my fitness is amazing. Look at this. I'm like not even breaking a sweat. Whereas Jasmine, on the other hand, is tuckered out, man. Okay, I'm starting to get a little bit winded. But still doing okay. There we go. Okay. Let's go see how many zombs are in here now. Okay, we cleared out quite a few of them. And I do have a golf club. Ooh, here we go, machete. Oh, and a baseball bat. Nice. Um, take the rest of machete. The aluminum baseball bat will be pretty good for us. And a shotgun, too. There's so many good things. We're going to have to make several trips here. Come back. Okay, food, and what do we got in this place? Bathroom, okay. Medical supplies in it, cool. All right, let's go, Jazzy. So, actually, hold on, swap me real quick. Um, actually, no, I don't want to give her guns. Here, I'll give you this, though. How about that? And you know what? I'll give you this for now. That'll allow me to pick up this and also this. Okay, and we don't need that golf club, so that should actually be pretty good. That'll save us having to make multiple trips. Let's go ahead and get back in the car. And away we go. Oh, this car's engine is getting a little bit shot here. Six food, two gas, one medical supply, and a bunch of ammo. Okie dokie.